do about Finn? I tried talking to her again. You could meet her somewhere. The Science Center or Trinity Church. No. She knows I lied to her now. She won't want to see me. <sighs> What's the 24th most downloaded app in New York City? Friendly Neighborhood! Dude, we're in the top 25? That's awesome! And a little scary! Getting close to the docks. Hope Uncle Aaron's there. Friendly... I gotta call you back. Oh. Hi, right, Miles. Spill it. Give me the whole situation. Finn, Roxon, Underground. It's just a lot, you know? You're 17. You're stressed. And you're a superhero. You gotta cut yourself some slack. You still making beats? Not much since I started this. Work-life balance, kid. Most important thing. Here. Little project your dad and I started back in the day. Our mixtape. Had rhymes ready and everything. How come I never heard about this? Because we never finished. We sampled street noise around the way. Wanted the city to be our beat. But your dad had the masters. And after things went bad between us... <sighs> you can finish what we couldn't. Plus, it'll take your mind off work. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What do I do? Load that up. I'll walk you through it. <clears throat> I'll set up holograms to guide you. Scan the source. Holograms, huh? You still in my moves? <laughs> this was in my playbook before you even born, young blood. Okay, don't think about Finn. Focus on sounds. Clear my head. Scan the holograms, and it'll unlock files on that drive I gave you. Help you figure out which sound you're looking for. Now try and find the original sound, and grab a clean sample. Try moving in a little closer. There you go. Yeah, 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 that's it. Rest of the sounds you need are spread across the city. I left a few messages for you, too, to help you get a feel for each location. Oh, dope. Not now. Hey! Get something you like? Yeah, really unique dynamics. See? Old man still knows his stuff. And you were right about clearing my head, too. I know what to do about Finn. I gotta see her. Try to talk her out of all this. In person? Where? Trinity Church. Tomorrow night. Why so interested? Because you got a target on your back the size of Jersey. You don't have to protect me. Someone should. <sighs> you know, you said you never finished this tape because of how things went bad between you and Dad. What actually happened between you two? It was complicated. We were too similar. Too different. Finish the tape, get all the samples, and you'll hear the whole story. Promise. All right. Thanks, Unc. Trinity Church. Remember, Tinker is yours, but leave the boy alone.
Man, I needed that. I was beat. Okay. Coffin. Hope she answers. Hi, Spider-Man. Finn, hey, we need to talk. In person. So you can lie to me again? So I can make this right. Please, meet me at Trinity Church. No more lies, I promise. If you're screwing with me, <sighs> fine. I'll see you there. At least she's willing to meet. Okay. Trinity Church, let's go. Your dad and I fell asleep listening to this sound every night when we were kids. It's got a good beat. Okay. Something rhythmic that was around when dad and uncle Aaron were little. There's a subway line near here. Pretty sure it's behind me. Rude. Maybe something mechanical? Exploding bridges are exactly what happens when we let vigilantes roam free. Right, right. Lock them up. Too far away. I think it's back there. Nah, getting too far away. Hmm. There's a subway line near here. Yeah, subway comes up over there. back there. Pretty sure it's behind me. That's not it. I need a way for the train to come by. Get close enough to record it. Yeah, that's it. You probably don't know this, but your dad and I grew up not far from you. Before we moved to Brooklyn in high school, hearing the clatter of the wheels, the squealing when the trains turn and stop, always makes me think of me and your dad's late night talks. Mostly about what we wanted to be when we grew up. 
wanted to be a space alien. Dad's dream changed. Doctor, firefighter, social worker. But he always wanted to help me. Yeah, sounds like that. Mom lived here right after college. You know that? She and your dad were dating. Three of us spent a lot of time here. We got used to this soft, steady beat. Soft beat. Yeah. It's subtle, but a good beat. Things were good back then. Felt like they'd be good forever. Your mom got her first gig as a teacher. Your dad was new to being a cop, and I just started calling myself the problem. I figured we all kept secrets about our jobs. But last, though, your dad's job and mine crossed paths too often. Man, Uncle Aaron, if you would have been anything else, my mom and dad would have supported you all the way. This one was all your dad's idea. You need something that's always in this park. Quiet on their own. Loud in a group. Loud in a group? Uh, hmm. I'm not gonna find it over here. Probably something you'd always find here. Like birds or trees or... No, no, not trees. Probably something you'd always find here. Like birds or trees or... No, no, not trees. How did Dad record this? Did you whisper? <sighs> this was way back, before high school. We were hanging in the park one day. Someone dropped the hot dog. You know how that goes. The place was swarming with pigeons. The dad stopped cold. He said, Aaron, man, that's music. Listen. Next day, we were crawling all over Manhattan looking for beats. Like you are now. I remember the first time they showed me how to sample. Uncle Aaron had the gear, and Dad had the ear for music. Yeah. This is a good one. Me and your dad used to hang around here. Listen while the whole station came alive. That's what you need. Something at the station. Has to be, think it's back there. I think hanging around here is how your dad got the idea to be a cop. I said, man, you're not uptight enough for that job. He wanted to make things better from the inside. I'm pretty sure he died trying. You did make things better, Dad. And so will I. Someone reported a civilian being attacked near you. Times Square. Easy to find someone in the crowd here. 
or lose them. Sounds you need like an electric current. A current? I could cheat it with venom. <laughs> nah. All of these people... Electric. Why does that work? I'm telling you. Maybe like a billboard or a sign? Oh, that's cool. I love how alive that feels. After I started calling myself a prop, met my first client right under this sign. Neon flags hard to miss, and the crowd makes it easy to blend in. She wanted me to steal a painting. I looked across the square and saw your dad looking back at me. He never said anything. Turned and left. He didn't know everything. Just that I was a thief. That was enough. I think he saw when we were heading long before I did. He would have tried to act right sooner. He would have forgiven you. I know he would have. <laughs> this sound always feels like someone celebrating. Even when it's just telling time. Your dad thought so too. So we had to include a sound that tells time. Okay. Ringing on the hour. When I hear those bells, I remember the last time I was here. Your dad had just graduated from the police academy. I didn't go to the ceremony, so I met him here after. Bought him some milkshakes. Strawberry for him, peanut butter for me. I don't know why I remember that. He said he couldn't cover for me anymore if I got in trouble. I told him I was done with that right now. I was lying. But he believed me for a while. Or at least pretended to. Man, things got complicated between them. Plaza and the blocks around it are alive with sound. What you're looking for is light, distinct. Light, huh? Okay. I like that beat. I'm not sure it's light, though. Pretty sure it's behind me. Yeah. Three times. That sounds good. This plaza is where I had my first job. I was fresh out of high school then. Didn't have the gear or the mask. God paid me to mug his boss. 
rough him up, take everything he wanted. Your dad found out. He stood under those wind chimes yelling at me for an hour. We never told our folks. He made me promise I'd stop stealing. Wish I kept my word. You deserve better. I wish you had too. Maybe you and Dad would have stayed close. I can't imagine ever turning my back on my family. Stop me if you've heard this before. Spider-Man chases villain through sea. Millions of dollars of property damage fall. We're still tallying up the damage from Rhino's rampage. Then the bridge and now it seems the junior menace decided to go for the hat trick with his new frenemy, the Tinkerer. I say those two should get a room. Trip. Have fun with this one. I had a repeat client I always met here. Got real used to waiting. Listen, hearing this sound running on a tight schedule. A sound on a schedule? <laughs> Yeah, that's cool. Fairy horns. That's right. The client I met here used to take the ferry over from Jersey. Work for him was good money. He got busted. He's how your dad found out about the problem. Not that it was me, but that a thief was making it big. volunteered for the case. I could feel him closing in. I had to try and guess which would be worse. I told him. He caught me. That'd be me. I... I don't know what I'd do. That can't be the only reason Dad cut him off. Not if he fessed up. It just wasn't Dad. In Harlem. Wonder what the last piece is. Man in subway tunnels. Guess a good thief needs a good hideout. He used to come to our place for dinner all the time. Guess he never learned to cook. He was always way better at guitar than me. Sequencer? Sampler? Vintage? Oh, has to be him and Dad's equipment. Always making upgrades. I definitely got my suit patching skills from Uncle Aaron. Uncle Aaron's got tabs all over the city. He must have been building his network for years. My mom bought him this at a flea market. It was a joke about... Uh, can't remember. the sounds. Frequency lock? <laughs> Something new every day. Hey, kid. Hope the suit fits. You asked why me and your dad stopped talking. He was investigating the Prowler. It led him to my clients, people like Simon Krieger, Wilson Fisk. Your dad couldn't afford to make enemies like that. Not with you and Rio in the picture. So I told him. Hoped he'd back off, and he did. For good. He didn't want me around. Didn't want you to turn out like me. Hope this suit 
helps you be better. Take care, Spider-Man. Thank you, Uncle Aaron, for everything.